Hey guys, Coop here. I had a friend of mine the other day ask me uh, how to uh, do the handle on a dog leash. So uh, I told him I'd do a quick video on it and uh, show him how I do it. I'm sure there are a lot of other different ways to do it, but this is just the way that I would do it. So if you guys uh, just bear with me, we'll get started. Uh, now this is just for demonstration purposes. This is not going to be a whole leash. But say for instance this is the whole leash. Imagine you got the rest of it up there. Well I'm going to put this on my jig. And what I'm going to do is I've pretty much got my starter rope looped. So to make my handle I'm just going to pull that over and pull it through. Like so. Just like making a slip knot. Well then I'm going to stick it on my jig and uh take one of these trusty you know high technical clamps here and clamp it so it doesn't slide down then I'm gonna take the other piece and hook hook up top the leash part of it so now you see I've got the the handle piece down here looped so we'll get started and uh, you guys all know how to do the the Cobra knot so I'm not gonna waste a whole lot of time showing you how to do that uh, obviously you'll have the cobra knot coming all the way down the leash so far so uh, I'm just gonna start right here with it and uh, show you guys how I do it Now I'm not going to do the whole thing. You guys can practice on that. I'm just going to show you how I tie it in. Okay, we've got a couple done. So I'm going to pull this down. Which, you know, if you were doing a dog leash, you'd just go all the way down to the knot. Alright, so now we're going to lock it in. And basically, what I, did, what I would do is I'd take and go through this piece then I'd take this one and go under just like you're going to do a regular cobra knot and before I tighten it down I'll pull this clip well then when you tighten it down boom it's locked in and now that I'm going to come across the other way I'm going to do it one more time go over this one under this one and then do your cobra knot now that's got it locked in so now the only thing is is figuring out your core here's your core piece and here's the top loop piece so now you just take and uh, follow your core just like so Now you guys get the hang of it see how the handles locked in up here you just continue on around to get to this end now if you want to do a double Cobra you just when you get to the end you just reverse it and go back the other way that'll give you a wider leash handle all right guys I hope this helps and if you guys have any comments or questions feel free to put them below but uh, doing it like this it'll lock that handle in nice and tight you just uh, follow your handle on around just follow it on around till you get to here and that'll be your single Cobra well then if you want a double Cobra once you get to this side like I said before you just reverse it and go all the way back around and then you've got a double Cobra leash with a handle alright guys I hope this helps once again like I said if you have any comments or questions 
feel free to put them below. I'll answer anything that you post up. With that being said, I'd like to say thank you to all my supporters out there. It really means a lot to you if it, or like means a lot to me. If it wasn't for you guys, there would be no Mr. Coop. I appreciate you watching my videos. I appreciate you supporting my channel. It means a lot to me. And uh, pretty much, Joe Coop's going to say, Coop out.